So the, when the reports came out, you know, uh, one of the, the dudes who got grace, he was in good condition, but both of the other dudes, they was in critical because both of them got shot in the test and shit like that. So I ain't going to lie, like, you know, last update I heard on the situation was that one of the boys who ended up getting shot in the chest, he died on phone. He lost his life, you know, and R.I.P. to a shorty, man. You know, these are teenagers. Like, the the one, the boy who got grazed, he was 15. The uh, two dudes who got shot in the chest, one of them was 19 and one of them was 18. I'm not, I don't know which one died, but one of those two died. I'm feeling one of them died and shit like that. And, you know, it's just a messed up situation. He's just, they said, I think they said he's from Elgin. Elgin, you know what I'm saying? Like a close town, close surrounding area and shit like that. You know, he's just coming to uh, see his favorite rapper at a concert, bro. End up losing his life, man. Sad situation, man. Everybody say some... Uh, Say some prayer hands, some doves and shit like that in the comment section. You know what I'm saying? Send some love, bro, because he was just coming to a concert and ended up losing his life, bro. You know, I know some people would be like, oh, he shouldn't have reached. He shouldn't have reached for the gun. Like, maybe you right. He probably shouldn't have reached for the gun. But it's like, bro, they young as hell. God damn it. They getting robbed. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit, you know. And mind you, like. These, they not from the trenches or none of that shit, bro. So it's like, they don't really know the do's and don'ts. Like, yeah, the procedures, when you're getting robbed, just give up everything, you know, like, and then mind you, you know, like, his girlfriend was there. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's a whole bunch of stuff. Like, you know, we can't try to paint it like, oh, he shouldn't have did this. He would still be alive. So what we finna make it like, it's his fault. He young as hell. He don't know this shit, you know. We got to, you know, dude and them, the robbers, they just some crackheads on phone them. They some crackheads. They trying to get some money so they can go get them some crack rocks so they can motherfucking get high off crack food. Like, that's all that shit come down to, man. You know, they bogus. We ain't finna say, oh, the white boy, he should have. It's like, nah, bro. They are, uh, We putting all the, the blame of being bogus on the robbers, bro. They bogus, man. You know? Then... They be robbing people and, you know, to still kill them after they done got the shit. Like, they done got they done, they done got what they came for. They done got the phone, the money, whatever they want, and still kill them. That shit stupid, bro. Like, what's the point? Like, now you got... You already had a robbery on your hand. Now you got a homicide on your hand. Like, if you would have got caught for this robbery, you might have just did, you know what I'm saying, a nice amount of time because they smacking people. They cracking people for robberies. 10, 15... You know, maybe even twenty. You know, you know this a this a uh, this a YT. You know this a uh, you know this ain't nobody who look like us. You know what I'm saying? They gonna smack you. Not even being on no western and shit. This just it is, it is what it is. Like you do something to a uh, a Caucasian female, you might get more time than you thought you was gonna get. It's just what it is. I'm folding them, so it's like you know. Yeah, man, now it's a homicide. Now you gone for the rest of your life. You don't fuck them. Your ass might get to jail. You know what I'm saying? Like, but, you know, RP to that, RP to that young man. Fuck them. Everybody say RP to that young man. But, uh, yeah, man, y'all let me know what y'all think about this situation. If y'all made it to this point, make sure y'all smash the like button, say what number like y'all is. Shout out to everybody keep putting up. Shout out to everybody that's on my MVP list. If you want to get on the MVP list, all you got to do is support by grabbing some OTM merch or just support by uh, through the PayPal and Cash App. You know what I'm saying? Also, I do update my update my list daily. So if you support today, your name will be on the list tomorrow. And also, I shout out everybody that's on my uh, list at the end of every episode. So with that being said, biggest shouts out to Run The Plays, man. Run The Plays. Biggest shout out to Run The Plays. Uh, Christopher King, man. Make sure y'all go show my boy CK some love, man. I'm folding them. Shout out CK. Biggest shout out to Roni M. On folding them. Her birthday just passed. Make sure y'all tell Roni M happy birthday, man. And then biggest shout out to my boy Uno Jojo, man. Make sure y'all show him some love up in the comment section. Shout out Uno Jojo. But um, 
And also, if you want to watch tomorrow's episode today, make sure y'all get over to the Patreon, man. We drop in full length uh, episodes on the Patreon a day or two days before we drop it over here. So anybody who want to watch content before it drops on YouTube, just get over to the Patreon, subscribe to the Patreon, and you can ain't got to wait until we drop it over here. You can see the shit early before everybody. But look, man, I love y'all. Shout out to everybody. Keep putting up. Y'all already know what's going on. Shout out to everybody. Keep tapping in, man.